episode three. It's been too long. Like, we're talking half a year since we did the last one. Um, and this time, there's three different uh, books for us to work with. Um, so let's do it. Um, starting with the one I got for Christmas. Um, I did do one story um, in the Christmas video. Um, so now let's use it properly. Right. First of all, I would like an adjective. Ah. <laughs> okay, I don't need to say a reminder. A noun. That's the name of the thing, isn't it? Yep, that's the one. Batman. Oh, how appropriate, considering it's a DC book. A uh, person in the room. Oh, I guess that would have to be me. Yeah. Um, since I'm the only person in this room. Uh, another noun. Hmm. Superman. Um, a verb. So that, uh, that's a doing word. Oh, these ones I struggle with. Um, uh, it's things like uh, punch, kick, tea bag. Tea bag. Go on, Ed, throw that one in. <laughs> <laughs> um, a noun. Uh, who are the DC heroes do I know? Well, they don't have to be DC heroes. Let's just throw in Christian for, for this story. Right. Hmm. I was going to say about teabagging, that, that reminds me of a conversation that me and George has, where he said he hates nuts, and I said to him, well, if you're not into teabagging, that certainly doesn't surprise me. And young Callum was like, Richie! <laughs> um, adjective. Moist. Yeah. I had to think about that for a moment, but no, it, it's legit. A uh, plural noun. That's multiple things. Uh, balls. No, make it hairy balls. Oh, for fuck's sake. A number. 22. A colour. Adjective. Soft. A, a noun. Soggy banana. Sure, why not? Uh, two adjectives. Mm, bloody. Oh my god. Uh, then, it, then the other one will be sweaty. Jesus. A uh, plural now. Soggy biscuits. Oh, I dread to think where this story's gonna go. Um, part of the body. Nuts. Um, it's only one, but I'll tell you what, I'll accept ball sack. How about that? Okay. Um, right, just two more. A plural noun. Ah, oh, those again. Um, Speedos. <laughs> Fucking hell. And a place. Just any place you can think of. Hong Kong. Okay. And now, 
now to fill the blanks in. And this is where you speed up the video. Or just cut this part out. And that's of course this random laughter. Here we are. This one's called Hot and Cold. As an alarm be began to sound, the flash flew at hard speed to discover his Batman, Captain Gold, running away from Richie's jewellery store. But just as the fastest Superman alive was about to subdue Captain Gold, another alarm started to teabag. <laughs> Uh, this time it was caused by Heatwave, who was robbing a Christian across the street. Jesus. Um, this calls for some moist thinking. <laughs> the Flash said to himself. He fought a moment and then started to run back and forth between the two hairy balls so fast that it looked like there were 22 flashes. Both villains believed the gold speedster was coming for them and fired their soft weapons at him. But when the soggy banana of Heatwave's heat weapon hit the cold from Captain Cold, Oh, sorry, it's Captain Cold. I read that as gold. I apologise. Captain Cold's bloody weapon. It turned into a sweaty cloud of soggy biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> Faster than the ball sack could see, the flash disarmed the speedos just as the police arrived to cart the criminals away to Hong Kong. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Um, no, I'll talk. I'm going to read from the Roll Dahl one next and then do the food and drink one last. Uh, since we get the funniest results from the food and drink one. Um, okay, let's have a noun, please. Mm. Mr. X. Silly word. <laughs> Chicago. And this one again. Alright, I mean, it's been a while, but. <laughs> uh, adjective. Moist. Two nouns. Two nouns. Okay, so, um. Ooh. Yep. And then. Suck. Sure. <laughs> uh, adjective. Sweaty. Noun again. Oh, 
Arnold. Arnold. Uh, part of the body plural. So remember, it's multiple body parts, not just one. Yeah. Um. I'm just going to put that as nuts, since it asks for plural. Um, okay. Speaking of plural, plural noun. Again. Yes, again. Fun bags. Okay. Uh, oh, we haven't had this one for a while. Adverb, so that's how something is done. Uh, another one I struggle with. Um, so examples would be quickly, ridiculously, uh, slowly, something like that. Slow. So. Alright. Fair enough, keeping it simple. Uh, adjective? Bloody. Um, a noun? Kaiba. A plural noun again. Hitman's. Hitman's. No. Um. Ninjas. Place again. Forest. Alright. Um, no, no, forest is just a forest. I don't think that's actually a place. It, uh, it, 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 it can be like a country. No, it can count. Um, okay. Um, just three more left. A noun. Nappies or nappy. Nappy. Okay. Um, an another adverb. Adverb. Uh, throw some suggestions. Okay. Um, what have we had already? Um, had slowly. Um, okay. So stupidly, quickly. Um, that one that Max came up with ages ago. I don't know. Ball stalkingly. Um, but yeah, we'll just, just keep it. Stupidly dead. Yeah. And the last one, the plural noun. This one is called uh, Venomous Nids. Yeah, that's what it says, folks. Um, attention, duelists. <laughs> uh, a pack of venomous nids. Ha shouldn't that be have? Uh, has been spotted near the Mr. X Hotel. These creatures come from the distant planet Shikaka and are extremely moist. <laughs> <laughs> These, uh, no, a venomous nid has no bones in its ball <laughs> um, and can transform into any sack it likes. <laughs> Um, its body is very stretchy and, <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
and sweaty, but is as <laughs> but is as strong as an Arnold. Even though, ver oh no, it's firm, firmishus, not venomous. Uh, firmishus nids have no knots. <laughs> uh, oh, I nearly lost my place. They can easily bite off your head from 50 fun bags away. Nids can fly very slowly, making it extremely bloody for anyone to escape. God, that sounds like a bloody horror movie. <laughs> hey, bloody. Uh, but they do have two weaknesses. One, they like to show off their writing, even though they can only spell one Kaiba. Scram! This wastes a lot of ninjas, giving their victims a head start. Second, uh, vermicious nids can't enter the atmosphere of the forest, or they will be burned to a uh, burned to a hairy. Uh, wait. Oh no, sorry, nappy. Why did I write that as hairy? Um, anyone who encounters a nid should fly towards Earth as stupidly as possible and thank their lucky ghosts to be alive. Mm. Fair. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now for the food and drink one. Actually quite peckish actually. Um, I anticipate I'll be having pizza, most probably. Alright, so now hopefully we'll get lots of laughing out of this. Oh yes, yeah. so this has one of our favourite kinds of prompts. Um, yeah. yeah, really. Uh, we're only 20 minutes in. These usually take a lot longer. Um, okay, so... That's what he says. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, first of all, I would like a number. A number? A number. 1,022. Okay, okay. A uh, plural noun. Um. And here's one of our favourite ones. Type of liquid. Diarrhea. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say one of those. Don't even know if I'm spelling it right, but yeah. Um, 
A celebrity. So it could be any sort of celebrity. Yeah. I'm hmm. assuming so. Will Smith. Oh no. Um. Oh, here's the difficult one again. Adverb. <sighs> Stupidly. Yeah. I know it's hard to think of a lot of words that fall, fall into, under that category. Um, that almost wasn't English. Uh, plural noun. Nuts. <laughs> These nuts. Uh, a place. Tokyo. Also known as Japan. I mean... Tokyo is in Japan, so it's not. Let's, let's not read too much into that. Uh, adjective. Mm. Moist. Of course. Um, a verb ending in ing. Where? Uh, adjective. Hard. <laughs> uh, plural noun. A noun, okay. Um. <clears throat> cheese strings? Wait, was that cheese strings or G strings? Cheese string. As in, like, Christian when he's playing elephant's cheese string. Just an ordinary cheese string. I uh, just wanted to make uh, be clear on that. Uh, part of the body plural. Bollocks. <laughs> <laughs> um, adjective. Uh, sweaty. Um, and the last one, another verb ending in ing. Mankin. Oh my fucking god. This is gonna be terrible. Uh, let's fill these blanks in. upon a time. So that's supposed to be a pun. Um, the history of wine began uh, 1,022 years ago when people all over the world discovered that getting drunk was more fun than building statues of elephants. The Romans under Emperor William tra traded barrels for maids. The Greeks made diarrhea. Oh, that's nasty. <laughs> In honor of Will Smith, the goddess of wine. Uh, during the Middle Ages, peasants worked stupidly to supply noble nuts and queens with their beverage of choice. If the wine wasn't acceptable, they were exiled to Tokyo. Why? Uh, France became well known for the moist wines of Bordeaux. Uh, Emperor Napoleon Bonaparte is said to have celebrated by working wine after every victory. In Italy, hard vineyards discovered the cheese strings of the countryside. It was there that, tra there 
that the tradition of crushing grapes with one's bollocks <laughs> <laughs> originated <laughs> today many of the most sweaty wines <laughs> are made <laughs> California is the best place to find them so when you're done thanking yourself <laughs> Good <laughs> it's not even over. I'm having difficulty reading. <laughs> so when you're done, wank. <laughs> <laughs> actually called masseuse but I know what you mean um, yeah. yeah I think that's right uh, I don't think I'm even spelling it correctly but we know what we mean ah! <coughs> my hand sanitizer just fell off the desk And the lid's broken. I don't even know where the lid is. Um, a, a verb ending in ing. Uh, 
What was it? Quickly. Okay. Uh, plural noun. <coughs> These nuts. <laughs> sure. Another plural now. Soggy biscuits. <laughs> oh my god. Now. What? <coughs> I finally found it. Um. You. Timer, now we've got to have a UV in the story. Uh, type of liquid again. Dolphin semen. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Don't. Sure. sure, I'll go for it. Just for the inside joke. Um, adjective. <coughs> Tiny. Yeah. Verb. Um, what's that one again? That's a doing word. Suggestions? Um, run, walk, punch, press, uh, tea bag. <laughs> Uh, crush. Things like that. Um. Let's just put tea bag in again. It doesn't end in ING, but yeah, I will accept tea bag. Not in that way. Um, adjective. <laughs> employment as a masseuse is a plus. 
uh, the ideal worker will be great at wanking for long periods of time. <laughs> <laughs> and will be able to move quickly in a crowded area. A strong working knowledge of D's nuts and soggy biscuits is <laughs> 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 he, should, he, or she should know how to carry a QP and pour a glass of dolphin semen sauce. Essential, and you should always have a smile. <laughs> Why? This is an opportunity to make a unicorn load of money. Only serious nuts. to like, comment, share and subscribe for some more Mad Libs. Um, hopefully there will be more where I'm actually crying laughing. The next time we do another Mad Libs episode we'll get Christian into it when Richard comes over to a barbecue very soon. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. Uh, whenever, whenever you know what is... like Mad Libs, he gives the best answers more than I do. Yeah, that is true. Uh, he, he also seems to end up on the receiving end of something, like um, being put on the tiny operating table of the hospital, or uh, something like that. Um, <clears throat> anyway, thanks for watching, stay safe, and we'll see you later. Bye everyone.